Audi things. Audi things? <laughs> now we both up here. <laughs> On this bitch. Pump it up while your feet are stumping and the jam is Manji it up, bro. It is the next day. We're heading over to the shop. We're gonna meet up with Tyler right now. Some of the last things that he needed did show up today, which was a day early. So as far as I know, it should be ready to go back on. I think he's got the down pipes all bolted on already. I don't know if he's actually already fixed the spider gear or the hose, whatever it's called, but we'll see when we get over there. We're heading over there right now and hopefully it should be back in tonight, at least sitting in the car. So let's get over there. Sure, she's running on her third tier. <laughs> But I'm sure that she all of this at, is. Ain't at 300,000 yet. <laughs> oh, this last 100,000 miles is gonna be rough. <laughs> now we both up here. <laughs> How the fuck did you do that? Ew, there's like boogers over here. I know. Oh. <laughs> there's this is not. Oh. <laughs> this is not meant for fat dudes. <laughs> This is a terrible idea. What kind of fucking toys do they got on this bitch? Rotors are good, sir. <laughs> Hog dance that shit. <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> Hold on, we gotta fight like Tyson. <laughs> 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 All right, so a little update. Everything is back on. Uh, down pipes are on, new gaskets. Uh, you even put the shifter on, nice. Um, all the new hoses, there's just one thing we gotta replace, but that's not gonna stop us from putting the motor back in. I think the goal is to get it set in right now and get it all hooked up. And I don't know if saying getting it started is kind of high hopes, but at least get it all in tonight. Damn, double fuck. check, triple check, quadruple check, plugs, vacuum lines, uh, AC lines, gas lines, everything. Everything. Because we do not want to rip this thing back out. It has been a mission. So I guess right now we're going to just get it back in, go from there. But ooh, oh, those are some nice little... Uh, Silicone hoses there, bud. Yeah, guys. $300 worth of hoses. That's what they look like. <laughs> that's where we're at right now. Thank God that these are V-clamps, because once it's in, that's going to be a whole lot easier. I guess let's try and set it in, right? Yeah. Let's not break anything up. You good? Yeah. All right, ready? Uh, pump up. Pump. Pump, 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 pump it up. And pump it up while your feet are stumping. And the jam is pumping. Look ahead, the crowd is jumping. Pump it up. We're gonna get to where the transmission is sort of covered. Then we have some wire to put on. And then we're gonna push it in some more. Alright. Let me lift some stuff up. Hold on. Let's move some of this crap out of the way. Come in just a little more. Okay. Ready? Yeah. Right there. So after a long, hard journey and uh, you know, hey guys, Chris Fix here, you know, we uh, finally got the motor somewhat in. Now we're just doing axles. And oh, it's floating in the air. <laughs> yeah, it's still floating. <laughs> <laughs> but an update video, we did kind of, update video, what the, f it's been way too long here at the shop. A little update on it, um, we kind of got it in. We're about to start hooking the axles up so that we can start putting the drivetrain in and set it on. Wait, are we doing that all tonight? Or is that going to be in the morning? I'm trying to get it much done tonight. Okay, so we're going to try and mate it all up. And then uh, that way we can't set it all the way in. It's pretty much there. 
we had a huge setback that the uh, slave cylinder did not want to go back in, and it was a brand new one, right? That was brand new, right? No, it's a, it's a new one. The boot on the slave cylinder was new. Okay, so the boot did it just it didn't want to work, so we had a huge setback on that. We finally got that in, and this is the progress where it's kind of sitting at right now. He's down there toying with the axles. Man, they were not kidding when they said, do not buy an Audi. <laughs> this, this is crazy. But it once it's done and everything is back together, I mean, it's got all new hoses. We checked the turbos. They are all good. No shaft, like, weird stuff like that. So they're still good to go. Um, the downpipes are obviously new. And he did the, redid like all the gaskets and stuff that he could get to. So... This thing but should be just to let you guys know if you get an Audi with downpipes, do OEM fucking gaskets. Do not do the fucking shitty aftermarket shit. They're just gonna break off and fucking fall apart after like a month. It's ridiculous. <laughs> yeah, he just put the downpipes on like a month, maybe not even a month before we pulled this one. And as soon as we took both downpipes off, both were just garbage so that's a little update where we are right now um I'm gonna do a little bit more and we'll pick up and kind of show the progress as it goes well she started up all right so we had to make a stop to home depot we got to find a toggle switch Hopefully they got one because O'Reilly's and AutoZone decided to, that they were going to close a half an hour early. So into Home Depot we go. If not there, maybe Walmart, oh, which I'm hoping that they should have one. But I guess we'll find out. Got a switch from here? Hell no. Me either. <laughs> so we're, we're really hoping that we can find some kind of toggle switch. But we'll let you guys know if Home Depot is the plug for toggle switches. Manji it up, bro. Don't crash, man. Scared. See, toggle switch, toggle switch, toggle switch. <gasps> Bingo. They do. Four bucks even. Probably cheaper. You want, Did you really want to? Or, or a button. That would be nice. That was only a dollar. Holy fuck. A dollar better be fucking good. Uh, but it's got a weird... Uh, this one or... This one has... Oh, because this probably has one that where it's like... You have to ground that light too. Yeah, I think you should be fine with those. Do you need wire too? Probably. He has wire. Oh, he has wire. All right, we're good. We found one. Apparently, Home Depot is where it's at. You can get toggle switches. So, is that all we need? Okay, speed racing. <laughs> Damn, that was a good launch too. Did you see his head? <laughs> oh shit! Send it into a manji. <laughs> All right, we're gonna get back to the car. We have the motor all the way back in. I think it's completely done and we just gotta put the front end back. Right now we are running a, cause we put a bigger fuel pump in. We're running a, uh, a kill switch in it right now. We're not gonna go ahead and show that for obvious reasons. Um, but after that's done, I think it should be ready to uh, assemble the rest of the front end. But motor wise and drivetrain right, drive train wise, I think that the car is actually all set. Is that right, Tyler? Uh, motor's completely done, right? Yeah. All right? We're just we're just figuring out we're just figuring out the fuel pump right now with the kill switch, and uh, after that we'll start putting the rest of this. But that's where we're at right now. We're gonna jump right into that, and I'll pick back up once it's in the clip before we went to the store. That was the actual first startup of the car. That was no edits, no nothing. That was the first startup that we got from it. So we're getting somewhere, boys. So apparently you stand in the middle, like spread out and just lift up. So basically what they're saying is you stand in the middle and spread eagle that shit, I guess. I'll let you try it. That way if it fucks up, you're only angry with yourself. <laughs> Why do they make shit so weird on these cars? They make it so much more difficult than it needs to be. Did that really just work? 
Yep. I take that back. That was fairly easy. So that's how we're gonna run the wire. All right. Dude, and we get free screwdrivers? Fucking what? <laughs> hey, we could have used those. <laughs> and a free styrofoam. I'm gonna pull this out so it's out of our way. Oh, we'll just set this up. What? And some drugs? What the fuck? Are you serious? Uh, Kenalog 40. What is the fuck is that? Injectable suspension. Find drugs and screwdrivers in your car. Drugs and screwdrivers. All right, boys, what else are we gonna find in this thing? It is an Audi, so you know, at some point in time, it was a baller mobile. Where are they hiding the money? Right? That's what we're truly waiting for. If, they, if we could find a hidden stash in one of these cars that we buy, that would be great. Are you ready, Chop? Audi things. Audi things? Yep. Ready? Good, turn it off. Hey guys, Tyler Fabs here. Fabs my ass. <laughs> All right, hey. I fap a lot though. You what? What? You fap a lot? Fap a lot. All right, so a little bit update. Um, it is back together. I think everything is done. We're just doing the final and the cooling in now, and then we'll put the front end back together. But then we can start breaking in the miles. I do believe, I don't know, there might be a clip or two more that I'll throw in here, but I think that's where we're gonna end this. We did get it started. Next video, we're gonna probably take it for its first drive after it's all set. So if you guys like this video, don't forget to hit that subscribe button. We'll see you in the next one. Peace out. Wanna say anything? Titties. Titties. All right.